set your seal upon my heart, the bridegroom says, for love is stronger than death. Many waters cannot quench love. There are some promises to be made according to the Word of God. There's a promise to be made. When I look in God's Word and I see what God expects of the husband and what God requires of the man, the promise you make here today are forever. And taking the woman you hold by the hand to be your lawful wedded wife, you must promise to love and to cherish her, to honor and sustain her in sickness and in health, poverty and wealth, and be to her a true and faithful husband till death alone shall part you. Do you so promise? I do. Do you take this man to be your lawful wedded husband, to have and hold from this day forward? in sickness and in health and poverty and in wealth. Be to him a true and faithful wife until death alone shall part you. Do you so promise? I do. When we think of the ring, it seals what's taking place today. It's not a contract, it's a forever. And it's by love and by God's grace. The purity in the circle shows that it's unending. It's from now till death shall part you. Repeat these words after me. With this ring I thee wed. With this ring I thee wed. And pledge all my love. Pledge Till death do us part. Till death do us part. <laughs> With this ring I thee wed. With this ring I thee wed. And pledge all my love. And pledge all my love. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. Father in heaven, we celebrate your love and your grace that is so real. As we come today for this wedding celebration, Lord, we thank you for that grace and for the love that you've shown. I pray for, for these families, these two families, Lord, that have become one. That God, you would make your face to shine upon them and show your grace to them. In good times and in difficult times. Lord, help them to show forgiveness and show your grace in trying times. I pray for those that are gathered here today, Lord, as we are here under the under the presence of you, Holy Spirit, that God, these families today would realize our responsibility to, to these two that have been wed, to the friends that are here today, Lord. I pray for them. Thank you for this day of celebration. praise you for all you've done, for all you've blessed us with. In the name above every name, the name of Jesus. Amen. James, you may kiss the bride. The authority invested in me, I pronounce their husband and wife. May I present to you Mr. and Mrs. James Monk. <laughs>